Welcome to another Spreadsheeters video guide. You can find written instructions for these steps on the Spreadsheeters website. In this video, we'll see how to save an Excel file to Google Drive. Google Drive is a cloud-based storage service that is used to store files online. Saving Excel files to Google Drive can be very useful when you want to um, either create a backup for your file or you want to keep your file safe uh, instead of saving it uh, only on your local computer. Another way in which Google Drive is used uh, quite often is when you have an Excel file that is very large, uh, sometimes you cannot send it by email. In such cases, you can save it to Google Drive and then share the link uh, or send out the link by email and give uh, set the permissions in Google Drive so that others can read your file. So uh, to save an Excel file to Google Drive, uh, there are two ways of doing it. So the first way is uh, to open the browser go to the Google Apps and select Drive. Of course, you need to have a Google account and be signed into the Google account to do this. So I uh, select Drive to open Google Drive and I will go down to the folder which I want to use. So now that I've opened uh, the folder in which I want to place the file, I can say New and I'll say File Upload. Then go to the location on, the, uh, on my local machine and select the file and say open and now you can see that uh, a window appears and uh, when the upload is uh, being done and now that it is complete it says one upload complete i can close that and i have the file here now the second way of doing it is of course to keep this open and have my file explorer also positioned close by and now i can just drag and drop it so I'm going to take this Excel file and drag from here and drop it into Google Drive. So of course, again, Google tells me that it's uploading and tells me also when the upload is complete. So now I have two Excel files added to my Google Drive. This is how to add an Excel file to Google Drive. Please read the appended article for further guidance.